Hello, so if you were born before the year 2000, you're going to like this video. My name is William Wade. I was born on August 26th. This date is unique to me. In terms of history, it's pretty unique. It's also a great day for my family to come together, and it's where we celebrate our traditions. August 26th, 1999 was less than four months away from the turn of the 20th century. If you are born below before the 20th century like me, you're lucky because you have the unique and rare opportunity to live through three centuries. Yeah, that's right. We can live through three centuries. And, well, this is so rare that only five people in the world have actually done this. And of those five people, all of them are still dead. So, um, that's what I was saying. If you are born before the year 2000, like me, we have the rare opportunity to live for three centuries. The date, August 26th, also is a pretty historic day. There's a lot of significant events that happened on it. First, a volcano on the island of Kakatoa erupted in the 1800s, and... It was a super volcano, and if it happened today, it would cause extreme destruction. On August 26, 1910, Thomas Edison created the kinetoscope, and that gave sound to movies, so people weren't having to interpret what people were saying in movies. They could hear what they were saying. Ten years later, on August 26, 1920, the 19th Amendment was passed, and the 19th Amendment gave women in America the right to vote, so the social division was starting to ease up in America. Pretty interesting. Uh, the year 1999 was also a pretty cool year. That was the year I was born. Uh, the year 1999 marked the beginning of Spongebob. Spongebob came out. It was a very popular show on Netflix, one of my favorite shows. It came out a month before I was born, making Spongebob older than me. Uh, it was also when the European currency, Euros, was invented. And Euros was used amongst the European nations as their new currency, and it started in 1999. What also happened in 1999 was the world population exceeded 6 billion. 6 billion. That makes my day feel so insignificant. That's pretty cool if you think about it. Now, August 26th is a pretty cool day, and a lot of cool stuff has happened on it, and to be born on this day is pretty rare, but it's also my birthday, and it's also rooted in tradition and family values. Some of those family values include my grandmother. My grandmother, she's very feeable. She's it has dementia, and she doesn't get out much. And it's a time where she comes out and she celebrates. We have the tradition of cooking our own dish, where we all make our own dish, prepare it, and create one big meal with all our dishes that we make. We also normally celebrate our birthdays at night instead of the day. And um, it's just a tradition we've always had. And um, our family's always liked bun cakes too. And um, we always have bun cakes at our birthday traditions because bun cakes, what you can do is, believe it or not, you can put them in the refrigerator and they'll probably last you a year. Every year we normally get one big bun cake and we split it and we save the leftovers for breakfast the next morning. That's just something we've always done. And um, it's, it's a really good tradition and it's nice to have traditions. And um, well actually a unique, a pretty cool fact about our tradition is um, this year, my brother's birthday, when we celebrated it, we couldn't get the full bun cake because the coronavirus, so we ended up making cupcake bun cakes, so we each had our own cake. So it was kind of our attempt to preserve our tradition in changing times, but really cool date. So let's go over highlights again. August 26, 1999. You get to live through three generations. You live on a day with a lot of historic events. The year itself, a lot of stuff's happened. Also, okay, I get to celebrate. So have a good night. Roll Tide.